something. in my phone is huge so I'll just figure out a way how I can do it with this so smash that like button if you just enjoyed that but that's not gonna be the end that's boring what y'all talking about boring so let's go find something else to do so we have to get it started now because I just cracked the egg so we're gonna go in the backyard and go check it out. One last look at the size experiment. Be extra careful if you ever want to see. So here we go. All right. Well, here's our step we're using. So let's get started. You know, I might do another trampoline video. So, I'm gonna hop up here from the other side so anything, nothing drops. Ah. Ah, this is gonna be hard to record. I really. Okay. Okay, let's see the view. Let's see the view real quick. Oh, y'all can't see that. Hold on, guys, while I get my set, camera set up. Okay, guys, this is the best I could do. So, move it up. Alright, so, for this experiment, you're going to need an egg and a knife. Be extra careful, so. The knife is just to help you poke a hole in the egg. I don't want to make a huge mess, so I'm going to do it over here. They'll be able to see after I'm done. No 
Malcolm! Why'd you do that? You didn't scare me. Update on what inside an egg looks like. Here's the Eggo. Sorry if it's not bright. Ugh, it's very bright outside. Y'all could probably see it good better than I can. So we're just gonna have to talk while we're doing this. While I'm doing this. You never know. Uh, oh. Uh. Oh. Uh, it looks like cheese. Uh. Scrape it by the side. So. Uh, I don't want to get the eggshell off. It's just the ego. Echo. Okay, so let's put that right there. Ugh. I don't like sticky stuff, so I'm not. Tr I'm trying not my hardest. Trying my hardest not to get it on my hands. Here we go. All right, let's grab the bread. Okay, got the bread. So let's put it right there. Take the egg out. Then we're gonna need the cheese. Gonna need the cheese. This cheese. Okay. Smear it. All right. It should be stuck on there. Let's get the again. Let's it with the. Oh, that's disgusting. Ugh. Grab it and stay on. Okay. Okay. Ugh. Oh, Lord. Here come the squirrels. Now you guys. So the fun thing about this is we're gonna cut it with the thing, and we're gonna get the juice inside of the bologna. Okay. So your bologna should be cut like this with the open mouth. Let's move the cheese out the way. Ugh. It's disgusting. Ugh. You just can cut the egg Y'all can't see what I'm doing right now. Okay, here we go. So we're just cutting the bologna. So the egg is under it, as you can see right there. Ugh. Now I can feel the shed, so I cut the bread all the way. So once you do that, you'll notice something. So I'm going to have to throw this somewhere where the birds and stuff can't eat it. Because this would probably be un unfair. And I, I, I don't want to give it to waste. But I don't want, also I don't want animals in my backyard. Because my backyard is pretty nice. Because we have a trampoline and all. Okay, so... There we go. Okay. Looks like it's not. Let's get the yellow egg. Trying to grab the snot. So the birds can come over here and eat it. Eggs are protein. Uh, 
Snap. Well, that's not the end of the experiment because we still have the cheese left. So let's do the cheese. Eh. You're probably saying like, Anthony, is your favorite? If your is your favorite subjects science? No, it's not. Okay, let's do that, and you have you a snot self sandwich. There's a simpler way of doing this. It's a snot sucking sandwich. I just formed everything together, and so, and we're good off of this. Now we can throw it on the ground. <coughs> <coughs> I am going to have to clean this off though, but if you enjoyed this video, smash that like button, and I'll see y'all later.